What's up guys, HM Process here, and today we have another invasion from Below Review. This time on Storm vs. Jobbeast. For the bag, we have this nice concept art Storm vs. Jobbeast invasion from Below logo. Item number is 44016, ages 6 to 12. There's 49 pieces. Jobbeast with Stormer, sort of minifigure. And, you know, Stormer and Jobbeast hugging each other. Front. On the back, we have a picture of Jobbeast. We have the actual size of Stormer. It shows. Jaw pieces, jaw can move up and down. And then we just have the region in blow in Spanish. Not very special here. Uh, let me turn Alright, um, we have a small instruction booklet. We have the crazy one kid who still exists. We have a hero hacker ad on the front. We have the comic, so I'm fighting this job he's running up. Now he's just eating stuff, I guess. He's chasing Daniel Capricorn. Stormer cuts out of nowhere. He starts to fight Job East. And the picture, the concept bar on the front. And, you know, he sticks his spear in Job East. So. Over here we have the building comic. And I'll go back here. We have combiners. I might build them, I'm not sure. Uh, probably not, because I think they all look really crappy, but... That's just me. Oh, here's a continuation. This is more of a combiner one. So, Jobbeast is running. Jobbeast is running some more. Combiners are chasing after him. More combiner stuff. And, we got it. Beast. There's 22 pictures. Well, nothing special here. So, oh, I'm surprised there's only one bag. Okay. Something fell. Uh, okay, here, of course. Alright. Most ex probably one of the most exciting pieces. Transparent light blue. Um, I don't know what you call this joint, really, but whatever. We have what Lego calls a plasma. Blade, cloth thing, I don't remember what Lego called it, but. This is the top part of Job Beast's head. You can see with the eyes. Now uh, we have new feet piece, or foot piece. Nothing really special there. And here's the lower part of his jaw. Yeah, nothing really special in the pieces area. So, I'm gonna go ahead and build it. Oh, yeah, one more interesting piece. We have jaw pieces on printed piece. I like this piece. I'm glad there's no markings or anything, so this can be used in mocks. Alright, so now jaw piece is complete. So let's just go ahead and start off with the main figure. So Rasper Stormer has silver chest piece, has a calm piece, a gunmetal spear. Um it's not made out of rubber like in 2.0, how they had the rubber things. Doesn't have that. In back we have the peg hole from the max. So, yeah. I'm. If you want to see more in depth, you can look on Stormer. Go to my review of Stormer Freeze Machine, because I don't really want to go too in depth on Stormer and Stormer Basic Jobbies. And let's just have a size comparison with our good old friend Jill and Mayfair. So as you can see, Stormer is fairly taller than him. Now let's go on to Jobbies. So here is Jobbies. Um, probably the, one of the first things you can tell is he's really, really small. Now, if you don't have the set, you may not be able to tell, but once you get the set, you'll be able to see for sure how small this thing is. And just to give you an idea, this is the scale of the leg. Yeah, it's really small. I kind of wish he was taller. As for the arms here, we have his little claws. Um, I don't think this spike is necessary. Right here by the claw. I think it would be better if they put it on here, but that's just me. And the same thing there. On the back, we have just a 2.0 armor piece, and we have a tail. Uh, again, I don't think the tail is a necessary thing, but it's a nice addition to the set, and I think it works out well. On the back, we do have a spike as well. And for the jaw, um, nothing too special here. It's just a purple piece, a nice little horn, 
and it goes up like this. One problem with the jaw is you can see through it. I don't like that, but it works out in the end. As for the body, um, yeah, I don't like how um, there's nothing down here at all. It's just this four size piece up here. However, that doesn't matter because most of the time you're gonna have Javi's pose crouched down like this because he looks best this way. So for the play function, what you do is that you open up Javi's jaw, you take Snorer, and I'm not sure if I can get this, but you stick this spear in there. Um, yeah, it's not the easiest thing to do, but I know you can do it. Just a sec. Alright, so you can tell the spear can't fit in Jobbies' mouth. It's not actually the easiest thing to do, and you take it out, chances are you just gonna have to move the headpiece like that, and then stick it back on. So, overall, do I think Storm vs. Jobbies is a good set? Um, really, the main thing to go on here is. Is Jobbies good? I think Jobbies is good. I don't think the size is like I don't I don't like the size of it. I think Jobbies should be bigger than he is, but it works out pretty good. So if I was gonna rate Jobbies, I would probably give it a eight out of ten, mostly because the size doesn't work out that much. And some things on it just don't look right, like on the body over here. You know if you have a cross, but when you have it standing up. That's just not right. It doesn't look good. It looks incomplete. Like, it just looks completely... In it doesn't look complete at all. It looks like it was just rushed here, and they just wanted to get something on top of there. So, thank you guys for watching. Until next time, I'll see you guys later. Goodbye.